Well, nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, joined for commentary by the former Arsenal defender Lee Dixon. And we can't wait for this one to start with justifiable calls. It's Erster FC Heidenheim taking on Dynamo Dresden. Yeah, thanks, Derek. My advice to the players out there is try and get off to a quick start, be accountable for your own performance, but above all, go out and enjoy yourself. Should be a great game. The lineup then for the hosts. Well, as a team, they do have their stylistic preference, and it really is all about trying to put the opposition under pressure, making sure that they don't compose themselves. Lee, do you expect to see more of that in this game? Yeah, pretty much. They love to press high, don't they? It's their preferred style of play, winning the ball high up the pitch. It certainly benefits their strikers. They're very good at it. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Wing backs are important in this setup. Did you enjoy your experience of playing at wing back, Lee? Not at all under Bruce Rock. It's a very, very demanding role, as we can see. The full backs are exposed both offensively and defensively. Lots of support inside them, but going forward, they need to try and get the ball into the box for the two up front. <laughs> And the match begins. Tomala. And it was a very good looking move, but alas, no end product. Posina. An attack full of promise, and a fine cross, and the keeper acquitted himself well. Yeah, it was a good ball in, wasn't it? But the keeper did everything right. It might be on for them, and the alarm bells are ringing. It did appear that they might be onto something, but not so. Dennis Tomala. Kleindienst. Looking for that final pass, looking for the goal that would put them ahead. Really good challenge. Can they get in behind them? It has to be! And there it is, the breakthrough. That will do nicely. Well, here it is, a striker's bread and butter. Simple finish, but it's the positioning that gets him the goal. Well, let's have another view of that goal. One nil then. Excellent first touch under the circumstances there. Showing a real will to win the ball. Tomala. Untidy on the ball. And options in the centre. 
attending to his defensive chores. Moving it forward. Well, he did his job defensively. And they've won possession again. Referee had to be mindful of what was going on, the injury situation, and hence he has stopped play. And a drop ball on the back of the stoppage. Really a very poor ball. Well, with your opponents bearing down on you, no wonder you want to just get rid of the ball. Now, will the cross work out for them? And the danger cleared. Robert Leipertz. Moving into the advanced position. A really committed challenge, and it's gone out for a throw-in. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Fruitful-looking attack. Well, nothing productive, really. They might be able to get in now. Is it going to be... Can he find the net? And a goal to level this contest! All even! Well, here's the replay, and it's an exquisite ball over the defence. And he chooses to use power in the finish. Not much chance for the keeper when it's hit that hard. Well, the earlier goal cancelled out. One apiece. Meinka. The hosts have had the lion's share of possession, but the rest needs work. It's too slow moving the ball. There's no imagination. Need a lot more from them. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Oliver Husing. That is that for the first half here. You've certainly got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Lee. Well, there's never a bad time to score a goal, but just before half-time can be crucial. And he's got his team back in this game. What can he produce? Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Oliver Husing. Throw-ins given. Schnatterer. Teammates in the middle, an unforced error, you've got to say. It might be perfectly set up for the counter-attack, you know. End product or not. Well, it looked highly promising, but it came to nothing in the end. Tomala. Well, they might be onto something. And by a wafer-thin margin, offside. And time for the change now.
Marvin Stefaniak. Ball's gone. Bush. Tomala. Kleindienst in possession. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Well, possibilities in the centre. Well, it was pretty straightforward for the goalkeeper. Leipertz. Bush. Robert Leipertz. Tomala. Unable to keep the ball. Meyer. Options in the middle. Well, he dealt with that ball played in rather well. And a strong tackle. Marvin Stefaniak. Cuts it back. And cleared away. Knipping. Good looking ball. That's a nice looking ball. He read the cross, but now must clatter it clear. And breaking at pace with Menace. Using his physical strength to shield it. He has time to play it over. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. And that's sound goalkeeping to hang on to the shot like that. Well, Derek, just look at those stats. Not created enough chances. They really haven't. They need to up the tempo, put the pressure on. Then they should win this game. It's not lost on them what a goal could mean at this late stage. Teammates in the middle. And it's gone behind for the corner. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes and now both sides will make personnel switches. And he's fired over the corner and first class defending cleared off the line. Looks promising this. Can they forge ahead? Yes is the answer. And that could be oh so important. Well, as we see from the replay, it's a classic pullback cross that sets up the chance. And the finish is superb. Sharp, clinical. It's a lovely goal. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Well, they've got to give just a little bit more. The fans are demanding it. They could get themselves back into this one. Kleindienst. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. That's a very impressive piece of defending. One minute remaining. Well, he's going to be disappointed with that pass. And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for full time, and it's a victory for the visitors, Lee. Yeah, well, it could really have gone either way. It was so competitive for much of the game, but they just kept pushing. They kept believing and probably deserved the winner in the end. Great result. Well, as we run the rule over this man's work, 
positive after positive, Lee. Well, grabbing that late winner was the icing on the cake. What a good performance from him.